If your pipes have frozen and you need to thaw them out, but you don't have the necessary tools like a torch, a space heater, or heating cables to get the job done, no worries because there is a no tools method that can be just as effective and believe it or not it's using just common household items that you probably have lying around. I'm going to show you what those items are and how to go about thawing out your plumbing. Coming up next. Hi everybody, I'm Leah of CJ Drill and at the top of the video I talked about a method of thawing out your plumbing without the use of tools. So let's get right to it. A hot water bottle. That's right. If you have one of these, you're on your way to thawing out those pipes. But if you don't have one, you can use a freezer bag and it can be just as effective. Now, if you don't have a hot water bottle or a freezer bag, but you have a hair dryer lying around, this will allow you to put direct heat on that pipe and get your water running. Now, keep in mind, if you have the hot water bottle or the freezer bag, you can use a hair dryer in combination with those items. So it'll just get that water flowing a lot quicker. Now you're going to need to heat up water. And if your pipes are completely frozen and you can't get water from the tap, you can always use bottled water or you can be really resourceful and use the water from the tank in the toilet. Now what you want to do is you want to identify the pipe that's frozen and the area of that pipe that is frozen. That's where you want to concentrate the heat. Now you want to take your hot water bottle here and you want to fill it with hot water that you've either heated up in the microwave or you heat it up on the stove top. Now it's really important not to fill the hot water bottle up all the way because you want there to be a little bit of flexibility so that you can wrap it around the pipe. Now, if you don't have a hot water bottle, don't worry about it. Just use the freezer bag, but make sure it's the kind of freezer bag that's got the zipper on top because it's going to really lock that water in place. You have to worry about spills and just give it time to work. You may have to take the bag, dump out the water, fill it up again and place it next to the pipe. It may take a couple times before you get that water moving. This is Leah saying you can do this. See you next time.